Hello! Today's video is about how to create custom course templates and how to use shortcodes in course funnels. Let's begin! To see your shortcodes, go to your course settings. Now let's go to our course funnels. Then choose your funnel. Click on Edit Funnel button. Now that we're here, first I'll show you how to use this shortcode to show your course on the course page. So just copy this shortcode and click on Course. Click on Edit Existing Page. Now we will create a custom course template. Let's add a header. If you already have your own header, you can put it here. But if you don't, we have a lot of available headers to choose from here. Just select whatever you like. Then onto the components. Let's add a container. Just click and drag it in place. Then delete the text inside. You see the container is small. If you want to make it wider, just remove the container class here. Then click on the plus icon to add your shortcode inside. Then search in custom code to paste in your shortcode. Then click on save. Now I'll show you how it would show on your student's perspective. Let's visit the course page. Now you'll see that the course is showing here because we added the shortcode for it. And the custom course template that we made looks like this. Now let's add more. Let's go back to our editing page. Let's add a footer. Just click on the plus icon and click after. Click on blocks, then select your desired footer. You can further edit the footer as you want. You can use the components if you want and just delete those that you don't need. Then save it. Now if we reload our page, you'll see the footer will be added here. Now let's add in another shortcode to add in students' progress that will show on the course page. So copy this shortcode, go back to your editing page, and you can choose where to paste it to show your students' progress. I want to show my students' progress here after the other tab. So let's click on Components. Let's add in an HTML button. Just click and drag it into place. Then click on the plus sign icon. Click on Inside because we want to paste the shortcode inside the button. Then go to Components. Search Custom Code. Select that. Then delete the button text. Click on the text. Enter your code on the side box to replace it with your shortcode. After that, Change the background color of the button to blend in with other buttons. Click on Style. And change the background color. Also remove the borderline. And as you can notice, this is a progress bar. So we do not need to specify the class. Then save this. Then now you can see the progress bar will appear here. Now let's use another shortcode for the drop-down menu. Again, let's go back to our editing page. Let's add another HTML button to place our shortcode in. And like we did before, click on the button, the plus icon. Choose Inside, search for Custom Code, and replace it with the shortcode. Then again, change your background color and remove the borderline. Then save it. And now we will see it's added to our page. The position of the drop-down menu is currently on the right side. But if you want to change it, just click on the shortcode and replace the word right to left. Then again, save it. 
and it will change to left position. If you want it centered, you can just change the text. Here, if you don't want the custom header, you can just remove it just by clicking on the components and click delete. Because on your course settings, you can actually enable the default header button. Now, if I reload the course page, you can see the default header will show. The course and the footer. You can further edit everything from here and it's up to you. Now let me show you how to use this short code for your landing page. Just copy the short code, then go to your landing page. Click on Edit Existing Page. You can paste your short code anywhere you want here on the landing page. So I want to paste my short code after this tab. So click on the plus icon, click After and select a container. Delete the container text, click on the plus icon, and now choose inside because we want this short code inside the container. Search in custom code, click that, and paste your short code. And remember, this short code will only show one course. Now, just add in a container fluid. Then save your changes. And now your course will show on your landing page. Let's visit the page. And when we scroll down, you will see the course here. And your customer can click here and the system will direct them to the order page where they can purchase the course. And now if you want to show all your courses that you have created, on the sidebar, click on course content. And just above here, you can see the short code for it. To show all your courses, just copy this short code. You can paste it on any page you want. So for example, I want to show all my courses to this funnel. Just click Edit Funnel. Then let me put it on the landing page. Edit the template. And again, like what we did before, you can paste your short code anywhere here on the landing page. Just repeat the process that we did earlier. Add a container for it and paste your short code. Then save it. Now let's visit the page. And here you can see all the courses that you have made because we placed in the short code for it. And that is it for today's video on how to create custom course templates and how to use shortcodes in chorus funnels. I hope this video helps you. And as always, thanks for watching and see you on the next one.